Okay, why is the headquarters empty now? I need to be able to show off my amazing micro DLC swag. Which is gonna be the main point of today's video, but obviously today is a pretty special day. It has something to do with turkeys. Happy Thanksgiving. That only applies to one day out of 365 days. The other 364 that you're potentially watching this on. Fuck it. It's not gonna apply, but we should still be thankful. I personally have a lot to be thankful for. First and foremost, if you guys didn't know, Nerd plays past a million subscribers. So we're gonna have to get a, a Melvin gold play button. I honestly can't imagine a gold play button with Melvin's face on it. Jesus. I'll do everything in my power to make sure that that happens. But as you guys know, it takes a while for those things to come in anyway. But I will be patiently waiting for it. And we should also be thankful for Belgium and Hawaii because, well, they're looking for some micro DLC reform. There's two things that grace my Twitter timeline today. The first one is saying that lawmakers in Hawaii are investigating EA over Star Wars Battlefront 2 loot boxes claiming that Battlefront 2 is a Star Wars themed online casino. And this other tweet says that lawmakers in both Hawaii and Belgium have now stated loot boxes are considered gambling. Belgium wants to ban loot boxes in all games in Europe. So if by chance this thing pushes through and you live in Europe, you are lucky as hell. You're not gonna have to deal with the Soplin Doplins anymore, as I call in my commons that I earned for free. Boy! Yeah, oh, yeah, okay. What the fuck? I don't know if this is just me, but it seems like the commons give you better stuff than rares anyway. And as far as I know, you can't, like, use COD points to get commons, so... Another epic? epic? Fucking grip. And this is the last one? And then sometimes it's just utter garbage. Speaking of which, I actually wanted to pick something up. I'm close enough to the shovel variant I wanted. Yes, please. Thank you. Woo! Oh, that looks so good with gold. I really could use like a heroic shovel variant so it covers the whole thing. That would just be perfect. Wait, can I prestige my shovel again? Oh. Oh, I want a shovel kill counter. I can prestige the shovel. Yes! I'm gonna lose my extended mags for it, but I'm just gonna have to do it. And now I should have the kill counter. I'm curious to see where this is gonna show up. Where? Uh, where's the kill counter? What? What? There is no kill count. What? Michael Cornbread, please fix. I need to know how many careers I've ended with this thing. Well, let's just do war. Fine. Oh, I forgot double XP's on. I'm hitting fifth prestige in this video too. As far as it goes for this whole loot box thing, I'm pretty sure it's in our best interest for all this to be happening. Because whether or not these things end up getting regulated more or they outright get banned, it's just gonna be better for us. Games will be less likely to be withholding content from us. Oh my god. They don't see me. They don't see me. Oh yes. Oh, shovel split. Oh my god, yes. <laughs> oh my god. I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna do it again. You're gonna let me do it again. Right now. Oh no, he's on me. If that guy wasn't there, I would have had it. Oh my god, this is a god lobby. But like I was trying to say, hopefully content stops being withheld. And hopefully we don't have to be pressured into losing all of our money. Now if loot boxes outright get banned, this actually could have some pretty bad repercussions. And I'll try to make sense of this. Microtransactions are making game companies a ton of money. Sometimes more than game sales and DLC. If microtransactions like this are just outright banned, they're gonna lose a lot of money. And the whole reason most of these publishers do this in the first place is because they have to make their investors money. So if loot boxes are gone, they're not just gonna lose a ton of money, they might also lose investors. Which means they'll have smaller budgets for games, which means that games will be lower quality. At least that's my understanding. All I'm trying to say with this is that there has to be some kind of healthy medium. I personally do feel that games that just have cosmetic items that don't feel like too pushy are okay. But I think it's safe to say that Battlefront 2 definitely crossed the line. And that really does suck too because it's a fun game. But yeah, rip micro DLC, it is surely possible. And purely from a player's perspective, I'm okay with that. A lot of the classic nostalgic video games that I played when I was younger didn't have all this stuff and they were great. Microtransactions and micro DLC are not inherently making games better. Oh, and I apologize if I'm running a little bit slow. I was up playing this till five in the morning. I've really got my fingers crossed that COD World War II stays how it is now. Obviously on Tuesday the game got COD points, but there's no supply drop weapons. I hope they do what Infinite Warfare did, where if you have the season pass, you can get base weapons for free. And if you don't have the season pass, you can complete challenges to get it for free. But if you would like to get some cool variants, you could, you know, buy supply drops. As long as no gameplay changing content is withheld in the supply drops, I think we'll be good. It'll just be nice to not have to worry about this stuff because I'm fucking addicted to the game, dude. I saw some people saying, oh boy, the COD points are here. It was fun while it lasted. But really, are you having less fun because there's COD points now? Because I haven't really noticed a change like that. Let's go, boys. Halfway. Halfway there. Oh, building this bridge. I uh, great singing. I'm getting so much XP. You can't sight me. You can't sight me. Ha! We built it. Suck me dry. This is the most beautiful enemy team I've seen. I've been blessed. I'm gonna have a hard time getting off today. Oh, my flame door. Oh shit! No, I shouldn't have thrown them. Okay, dude. Oh my god. Mm, here's the quad feed. Let's go. I fucking, I knew that was gonna happen. Hey, buddy. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm a fucking savage. Like, what the fuck was that? I hope this lobby never dies. Yes, please, more of this. Hold up. Hold up. Hey, buddy. Oh my god. No! I love to Hey, buddy. I'm really helpful. Yeah, did we do this? Did we do the thing? They're all. This is ridiculous. Oh my fucking- Oh! No! 
I just, I just choked the most spoon-fed clip of all time. Gotta visualize the clip. Visualize the clip, you'll hit it. Enemy reinforcements arrive. Son of a bitch. Let's get that W. Let's get that W. Oh, he was just about to melt everyone. Did not work. I'm just being honest, because of the holidays and stuff, I don't think I'm gonna be able to get this shovel video out. I don't necessarily wanna hype it up to be something bigger than it actually is. It's really just a fun project that I'm looking forward to making, but I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna have it out as soon as I would've liked to. I just don't wanna sacrifice the quality of this video. Get the fuck out of here. Bro, I'll shovel you and your whole family. What are you trying? What are you trying? Dad. Do hardcore Dom real quick. I'm gonna use an SDG class. I got this heroic variant for it, so I figured why not. I can go full sweat up in this place. What? That sh I feel like that should have killed him sooner. Wow. Fucking wow. I just got five on by an SDG, but there was a team kill in there. I think I have enough XP. I just want to lose this and get it over with now. <laughs> oh my. Oh, the Prestige 5 icon looks so good. Let's go. But yeah, that's gonna do it for this video. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this COD World War 2 video. And let me know your guys' thoughts on the whole, like, RIP micro DLC thing. Because it does have the potential to set a huge precedence for gaming. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did and you'd like to see some more COD World War 2 stuff, make sure to drop a like. And I'll see you guys later. Mother